Hey guys, this is Mr. Crayfish and welcome back to my redstone tutorials. In this tutorial today, I'm going to be teaching you how to build this hallway arrow trap. So I thought I would continue on the theme of traps and I've decided to build a new contraption and this is the hallway arrow trap. I'll show you how this works. So um, say you're in a PvP server or that or you want to prank your friends. Um, you could set this up and they'll be like, oh diamonds, there must be diamonds in that chest. I'll head in there. Oh no! Oh god, it's a trap! Ah! No! Oh god! Horrible death, horrible death. Now, um, obviously you wouldn't put this on the surface. If I was going to build this in some sort of PvP server, I would build this underground as it would be so much easier to hide the redstone. Um, so I'm going to show you how to build this now. So what you are going to need is 10 redstone dust, one redstone torch, one redstone repeater, five pistons, one stone pressure plate, one dispenser, 64 arrows, one cobweb, and 64 block of your choice. So the first thing that we need to do is get a hallway. If you don't have a hallway, make one! Um, I suggest that you have the hallway underground as it's going to be easy to hide the redstone. If you do it on the surface, it's going to be hard to hide the redstone and someone might figure out that it's actually a trap. So I'm just going to create a five long hallway um, just for tutorial purposes. Um, I suggest, as I said, um, to do it underground. So you need to make sure that it's a two... It's a one wide hallway and the ceiling is too high so we're going to create a roof on this. And there we go, we've got our one wide and two high hallway. So I want to put my pressure plate on this block here so we're going to dig it out. And then we're going to dig these two blocks to the right here so one, two like that. Place a block back on it and then put your stone pressure plate on top. We're going to come around the right here, in that hole, place two redstone, one on this block here, a block behind the redstone and in front of it, and redstone on top of that. So in line with this plank down here, we need to dig out these two blocks here. We also need to do it for the right side there. Now come inside the hallway and what we need to do is place a piston on top of this block here facing towards us and also one on top of it like that. Come to the left side and do exactly the same, a piston facing towards us and one on top of that. Now if we step on this pressure plate you'll see that only the bottom pistons come in. We're going to fix that so if we come around the side here we're going to place a block diagonal to this piston here like that and the same on the other side. Then we need to place a block um, to the right of that redstone and one to the left of this one and then put your redstone dust on top of those blocks we just placed. Now come on to the roof and to the left of this redstone here at the end we're going to place a block and then a piston on top of it facing towards us, well to the front. Place a block in front of that piston. Now on this edge block here which is in line with, the, with that redstone down there, place redstone, then to the right of it, place a block, then a redstone torch on the right of that block, place a block on top of the redstone torch and then you want to get your redstone repeater and face it towards the redstone there and you want to put it on a two tick delay. It's already on a one so all we've got to do is hit it once like that. Now to the left of this redstone here, place two blocks on top of each other. Now come under here and what you want to do is just destroy the pressure plate just so you don't activate it or place it back after. So you want to dig out the block that was above the pressure plate here. Do it one more time. And then we'll place our dispenser facing down like that and insert our arrows into it. Now get your cobweb and what you want to do is place it in front of the dispenser. Place two blocks in the gaps here so it fills it up and then place your pressure plate on that block that we had it on before. So there we go guys, that is the hallway arrow trap. Now we're just going to test it as we always do at the end of each tutorial. So let's go ahead and step on this pressure plate. 
Oh no! Oh god, he's got me! He's got me! Oh! The terror! <laughs> Alright, well there you go guys. That was the hallway arrow trap. If you enjoyed this tutorial today, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more of these, remember to subscribe because I do post them quite frequently. Um, if you have any ideas for redstone tutorials, let me know in the comments because I will read them. That is all I have to say. Remember to leave a like and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.